And hello and welcome to today's um, game, you could say. It's um, the rematch from the tournament, which couldn't be finished on the yesterday, basically. I think it was yesterday, yes it was yesterday, because we had some interferences, but um, this is going to be the last game of the tournament. Whoever wins this is going to win the tournament. So we, we once more have the team of, of Button, Old Man and Meat Band against Sanek. Hips and today Zeeds, because um, there were some interferences with Pew Tiger, he was disqualified, I think. However, the nations are still the same as usual. Two Kiemonts and one Ukraine each team. I hope we are going to see uh, quite some interesting battles here. It appears like Button is instantly going for the Siege Cossacks, while Sanic is going for the Hetman again. Both might be a good choice. These Siege Cossacks are pretty good at destroying early game. Well, um, raiding I mean. Whilst the Headman are better at dealing overall damage in the early game. But if there's enough Dragoons, they, they can simply take the Headmans out. And the Siege Cossacks don't stand a chance, considering they mostly won't engage either way. Same with Hussars. So the most of the major damage is going to be inflicted by the headmen, which are just able to bash through every pikeman formation. And it appears like everybody is going for pikes again, as usual, except for the Ukraines of course, because the Ukraine cannot build any pikes, which is obvious, and apparently Zeeds is making some some knights, some raiders, and I don't exactly know why he could make he, he could continue making his 18 dragoons instead, which provide a little bit of firepower. And if he uh, if he uses them other than in, 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 in another way than hips does, he he won't have a super slow shooting and moving army. So uh, that might actually be beneficial for him. But. Uh, if he thinks that Raiders are better, then I think he knows what he's doing. Though Zeeds also seems to be... Never mind, he doesn't... Well, he is the only player on his team who is going for the third town hall. Um, every other player on the enemy team has the third town hall earlier than him. But at least he is, he is doing it for his team. So his economy is going to be better than everybody else's on his team. While the economy of Button is going to be overall better than the team of Sanek. I think that the team of Sanek is going to try and be very offensive. Because otherwise there wouldn't be no there wouldn't be any reason to make only two town holds when you could actually have three. And Sonic is also going for Siege Cossacks now. And he almost got destroyed by some Sodiux of Baton, which they uh, almost charged into. They only took some shots with the, with, with the Siege Cossacks, but it still wasn't very smart of Sonic. Uh, and Baton is falling back again. I think it's a smart tactic because his Zerdux probably are not in upgraded enough at the moment to take on the pikemen of the uh, of uh, Zeeds. And if the team of Sunday keeps sitting back like this, they are going to simply get out economized. I hope that's the word, and uh, get destroyed. And I don't think that the team of Sonic is actually going to play on economy, apart from Deeds probably, because he has three town halls. Means that his economy will grow way faster than uh, Hips and Sonic's. And uh, considering that Hips is moving slowly upward, is is then is indicating that he's going to attack in the in the short term. And 
it appears like some like siege cossacks are destroying a, a little unit of meat band sosas which is effective but i don't think that this is too much of major damage right now considering that the hussars are still in rather low numbers and Sanic is just letting the Siege Cossacks stand nearby the enemy army and some of them will probably die to a pike formation actually Sanic is moving his Siege Cossacks quite quite smart even though he is moving them rather he's positioning them to stand somewhere very unfortunate positions and now Sonic is going to destroy Meatband's economy. Deja vu, because even yesterday when we had the tournament games, Meatband was always the one who had to tank the damage first. And Sonic managed to pull up the, to pull out the Siege Cossacks into the next formation of Meatband's peasants. And Sonic is barely taking any damage. Now it's Meatband is losing his entire economy, apart from the mines of course. The Siege Cossacks are not known for being able to attack mines. Meanwhile, Zeech and Sanex Sardukes are apparently preparing for a defense against Baton and Meatband's units. Which Baton is actually going for, re for Register Cossacks now. So uh, he actually made all, all stable units of the Ukraine once this game. Congratulations, but I don't think that um, changing that much is actually going to be too beneficial for him. And Zeeds needs to charge in now. Yes, this, this tank run formation of Sturgix from, from Sonic is going to be efficient enough to, for the pipeline of Zeeds to push, to push forward and inflict massive casualties on buttons formations and hips is falling back again from old man and hips dragoons are totally out of position so he cannot defend his pikemen at all that's the negative side of being so slow i mean it's okay if you are slow in some circumstances i mean ardl is slow at loading and uh, that's fine, but he's actually playing, playing rather fast. And Tips Dragoons are still shooting very slow. So um, we can at least say that Tips is honoring his title. But from the looks of it, it looks like Oldman seems to lack some kind of ammunition. And Barton's base got destroyed. My game has frozen for some reason. I hope this is going to resolve. And if, if I think it does, uh, it's frozen again. Help! Somebody summoned ice, I guess. I hope that I'm not missing too much right now. Otherwise, that would be quite unfortunate. Apparently, everything has turned to shit again. Because this priest somehow 
made meat band crash. Though Baton's base is clinically dead. And uh, somebody unpaused against Colorfit's orders and it's freezing again. Very intelligent, whoever did this, if you see this video. You should be ashamed. And the game is officially dead basically. Massive desync. Button is quit. And only old man is left. And uh Call of it is going to decide and basically think about if this is going to be a rehost because something shitty happened right here.